For week 12, our assigned reading was an article entitled, We Know What Works in Teaching Composition. This is by Doug Hesse, um, and it's published through the Chronicle of Higher Education as an article, and it was published January 3rd of 2017. There's a lot of really good points in here that I really enjoyed reading about. He starts off by using an argument made by a professor that we are teaching students um, the wrong type of composition. And the core of the argument that this uh, more traditional professor was making is that it's not, writing is not about the uh, process, it's about the outcome. And um, which really is not true at this point from what we have learned through research is that being a good writer is about the process and not necessarily the product. You have a better product through learning how to do a proper process, if that makes sense. Um, and so just making sure you're teaching um, a lot of different points of how to write and not just looking at the final product, but looking more at the whole experience of writing. Another um, factor that he brings in is classroom lore which is just passed on experiences or techniques that professors or teachers in general may have used in the past that have worked in their own experience that may not be based on research, uh, which it's to not discredit their experience, but it is important to look at what is backed up by educational research, which will play a big part in how students learn and how to be a productive teacher. One way that is really um, ingrained into this article is talking about process um, and what works for students. So one quote in it is, students have ample opportunities to write. Professors expect them to write frequently and extensively, and we demand and reward serious effort. So that is not saying we are looking at the product completely. It's saying more of what are they doing? Do they have enough opportunities? Do they have enough tries? Do they have enough areas to be successful? And it may take a few tries to be successful and that is okay. Another point he brings in is um, reading is an important part of writing and it's um, beneficial to read interesting text, books, poems, all varieties of writing and then discuss what those authors or writers may have been trying to achieve and talking about what their process may have looked like. Because once again, you're not looking at product, you're trying to look at process and that is what will make a successful writer.